I just flipped the disc. Last week was crazy. Mark's back went out and Alan had to step in. Well done for producing the best dance so far on season 22. I'm happy you're okay. You know, we'll work with some other people to kind of help me get through so I'm not like over straining myself. <laughs> It'll be a day by day thing. Cool. My most memorable year is 2014 and it's when I had my first UFC fight. When I was in high school, I had a very, very tough year. I was very bullied. Um, I went from being like a 4.0 student to not showing up to class and missing almost the whole entire year. I couldn't go to class without people trying to throw trash at me when I walked by. I completely lost who I was as a person. Because of all the bullying, I found fighting and it made it all worth it. When 20-year-old Paige Van Zandt enters the octagon for the first time tonight, she will do so as the second youngest female fighter in the UFC. I wasn't meant to win that fight. I had a lot of people doubting me. And now, patting away on Kern, who's hit some trouble here. She was facing an undefeated opponent, but that didn't shake her in the least bit. In her mind, she was going to win, and she did exactly that. Paige Van Zandt with the stuffage win in her UFC debut! Paige Van Zandt is just getting started, and she's one of the top 10 best fighters in the world. I completely just owe my life to fighting. It changed everything for me. Yeah, do that one more time and be a little bit more flexible with your back. I fought through such hard things that were supposed to, like, break me into nothing, and I made it, and it's okay. It's okay, man. <laughs> Don't yeah, make yeah. me cry again. I'm a fighter. I'm not a crier. <laughs> Drag him over here.